what's now everyone in this video tutorial I'm gonna teach you how to use icons in your current website so to do that we go to the website icon moon and we make the selection of the icons that we wish to use we generate the font and the next step is to download the font package we unzip the file once you do that you need to drag and drop the fonts folder to your website folder open up the style CSS that is included in the file copy the whole code and paste it inside of your style CSS now we have to declare the path where our fonts folder is located and style CSS is inside of the CSS folder that means that we have to go outside of the folder so they can find the fonts that we have inside of the inside of the file to do that we are going to go backwards one directory and to define that we type two periods and a diagonal and now we click on save I'm gonna create a container now I'm gonna create a row inside of this row I'm gonna create a column and inside of this column I'm gonna create a row inside of this row I'm gonna create a, another column and that's where I'm gonna add the icon that we wanna be using create an i tag give it a class with the name class that we that we copy and paste from the style CSS click on save refresh and this is the result the next thing I'm gonna do since I'm nesting these columns inside of a column I'm going to create I'm going to create another column that's going to fill up the space of the entire 12 column span so this one is going to be equal to 10 I'm going to create an h3 tag now I'm gonna add some lorem ipsum text refresh and now you can see the result where the text is on the right and the icon is on the left I'm gonna add some styling to our container by adding a background so class background a font color white and a padding 
of 70 pixels top and bottom, 0 pixels left and right, refresh, and this is the result. Now, as you can see, the icon is a little bit too small, so I'm going to increase the size. Target the eye tag at the font size of 2M. Refresh. And this is the result. For the H3, I'm going to add a, a font weight of bold. Refresh. And now we can see what the result is. Now, I'm gonna duplicate this, this, uh, this column of four two times, so I use the full uh, 12 span column. I'm going to add different icons. And that's how easy it is to use icons in your website. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. And if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to ask me in the comments below. And see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.